Hey family, this is Fortune. <laughs> and all you know doubters out there, would you listen in to today's tip on how to live, live a life of no doubt and just blessings. So to my MLMers out there, you have to, sometimes you're getting to this position, it's an awkward position. You're walking down the street or you are in, the, in line at a checkout stand and you're seeing somebody around you that seems like they could be kind of sharp. Something about them gives you this vibe like, I need to talk to that person. So what are you going to do? How do I open up that cold contacting, that cold contacting uh, at this point? What do I need to say? Here's something that I believe will help you a lot in just getting that icebreaker. Now, I learned this from uh, some, some dating skills from back in the day. So, but I'm going to, so I'm kind of telling on myself a little bit. But these little, little things like this opens a door for communication. Just to get the, the door open for you to start saying something. Just to start to get to know someone better. To build a little rapport with them while you're out there. All skills that we can learn, um, you can learn actually on this blog. The thing what you're going to say is find something to compliment them about. In the book, uh, How to Win Friends and Influence People by Dale Carnegie, you find out just saying the simplest little thing is like if you see somebody's nice shoes on, just stop complimenting a person, a man on the shoes, especially complimenting a woman on the shoes. And men, if you know even more about those shoes than the average guy, like whether it's straps or mules or whatever they are, then you've been able to say that one little thing or even knowing the name of those shoes, the brand name, wow, set you in the door, set you apart. Uh, but it's just opening the door. We're not talking about dating strategies, just getting the door open. What if it's just the fact of, you may have heard them, be, uh, uh, may have heard a mother talking to their child or whatnot, or they're being, the children are being well disciplined while they're, out, while they're in the grocery store, wherever you may be, and you're just complimenting on how well disciplined the children are. You know, maybe talking to a man, it may be talking to a man, you say, oh man, I like that car. How, here's a question I love using right now. I like Audi, so I, I would tell a gen ask the gentleman, how do you like the way that Audi rides? I have yet to hear a person not get excited about that uh, answering that question. Okay, It just opens a door to start getting in there and to start actually asking the true questions. Hey, so where do you do? Where are you from? Getting into that, to that form conversation. Family, occupation, recreation, message. So use that. Compliment someone sincerely on whatever it may be that you see in them. And one, one thing you may want to use, the main little tip if you're not even good at finding the compliments is this. Start looking for some, some things to compliment somebody about. Try it at work, try it in your house, try it with your, with your friends and family. Just start complimenting somebody. Be genuine about it. <laughs> be use genuine comments. Now if you know someone looks a mess and you come in and tell them, man you look great! That's not cool. <laughs> you know someone looks a mess. So, use this one little tip here to get, start opening up the door, get your foot in the door for your code contacting. Uh, just con use that compliment someone. Open the, get the door open and start forming them right from there. That's your tip for today. Let me know how it goes when you go out there and using this little tip here, practicing with your friends or family. Leave a comment down below. Let me know how this is working out for you just to start opening the door to get in some conversation that you might not thought you have been able to get into because you didn't know how to open them up. Use this icebreaker. Talk to you later.